thousands of nomadic families and their livestock depend on this newly rehabilitated borehole in Mudik region in central Somalia. The community leaders say that since it was commissioned, life has improved. More than 2,000 families depend on this borehole as a water source. Pastoralists used to avoid it before, as it had not been rehabilitated, it had no elevated water tank and pump, and it was too difficult to get the water for the livestock. But as you can see now, all these camels come from as far as 35 kilometers away. In the past, women and children had to walk for many kilometers to get the precious water, sometimes facing threats from wild animals. But things have changed for better now. We used to fetch water and get water after walking for several kilometers. But since the installation of this borehole next to our homestead, we can easily access it for cooking, washing and cleaning activities. Despite only having limited resources, international development partners, together with the federal government of Somalia, say they will continue assisting the most vulnerable communities get water. Initially, we have made some assessment. We have made some assessment for this uh, settlement. And uh, from based on that assessment, we have found uh, that this, this settlement uh, faced a lack of access water. So we have rehabilitated the shallow wells. Uh, and the rehabilitation involves construction of elevated water tank, uh, construction of caretaker's room, and a water kiosk and the installation of solar system, which has a high pump water capacity. As the government of Somalia continues to step up military operations and free new areas which were not under its control, many living in such places will be desperate to get essential services, such as water, health and education. Mohamed Kahi, CGTN, in other settlement in central Somalia.